Okay, so walking in another man's shoes. That is something we used to say in my day. Um, I have been tr uh, transposing that into another uh, wordage. Um, I'm talking about wearing the weird suit. In other words, there, there are other ways of thinking. And I have a friend who's whose man is a flat earther and she can't stand it, it rubs her the wrong way. But you know what? I used to think that as well, but what's wrong with walking around in a flat earther suit for a day? I'm pretending that uh, that, that works for you, that you believe it, right? And And then you get all of the, you can filter all of their ideas and their thoughts and their, and wear the outfit. Wear the suit, wear the weird suit, and then take it off the next day, right? Now, this is my idea for coming together for unity in the world, is that if, and I think we're doing that. I mean, um, women and feminism wore the man suit. Uh, we've discovered that sucks if you're a woman. Not a good idea. It doesn't fit. The suit does not fit, you see, and that's the thing. And so... Now, okay, I've been I put on a flat earther suit for a while and then I thought, well, that's not crazy. I mean, the way the logic works, they've worked the logic, you know. Okay, so there's that. But then um I've gotten to this place lately where uh okay, I couldn't be a Republican. I hated that idea. So I started watching Fox News and all that for a while and I watched Tucker and all those guys and what happened was in time I noticed Tucker changed too. Right? And so what I'm discovering is that a lot of people are starting to wear each other's weird suit. And when we do that, we find, well, maybe they're not all wrong. They're not all bad and wrong. They aren't. They have ideas that work for them. And why? Why does that idea work for that guy? Well, a lot of reasons. But the point is, if you wear the suit, you can get closer to the whys. And I think the whys are really important. I think the wise help us to have compassion for ourselves and others. So today's uh, note is put on a weird suit for a day. Oh, and by the way, the trans people, they're just taking it a little too far. <laughs> because guess what? They're putting on a weird suit. Now they're wearing woman, clown woman face and uh, saying that they are the weird suit. But you see, that's the point. Don't put on the weird suit and then think you are that weird because you're not you are a soul you are a living breathing god and goddess made into one soul and this soul is feeling its way through life and experience and truly life is an experiment it is god's experiment and it's holy all right so all we have to do then is just try on the outfits Wear them around, see how it fits, see how it feels, figure out, well, is it too long in the waist? I'm short-waisted. I can't wear this long-waisted outfit. You know, when I see Russell Brand standing out there, and he's got these pants on so it looks like they're like halfway off it, but he's long-waisted. So he's got this slim, tall drink of water look that a lot of guys have with that long, long torso. I'm like, wow, I think that it looks so cool because I have a girl, girl figure, a girl shape. And so, it, you know, it's foreign to me. I could never wear those low slung hip hugger pants, right? So you see what I'm saying? We can try to fit in to a pair of hip hugger pants. But the truth is, if you are an hourglass figure, it's not going to fit. So, but it's fun to try it on for a day and be hiking your pants up all day and see if you can possibly make this work. Because what does that do? It brings us, I think it brings us compassion. That's what I think. And I think compassion we need. And you don't get compassion without some understanding, which is a number 12 in the astrology block. Uh, number 12, understanding is Pisces and Jupiter and Pisces, the 12th house and Neptune. So those um, energies represent how do you understand something? Well, be like the octopus and put your little suckers on something and try and look just like it and see how that goes for you. What does it feel like? What does it smell like? What does it taste like? Does it fit? Is it comfortable to wear this outfit or not? And why? Why? Ask yourself 
Why doesn't it feel comfortable? What is it about this weird suit that doesn't feel comfortable to me? And what is it about it that I enjoy? All right, that's it for today. I love you guys. I love being alive and I love all the living beings. So, later.